Yo, what's up guys? Left first here, and today we're gonna do a Beyblade battle between the balance types versus the stamina types. Now I tried to make all the Beyblades chosy, but the balance type had four chosy Beyblades, and the stamina types only had three chosy Beyblades, so I decided to include one god bay with the stamina types, which is gonna be Galaxy Zeus. Now I know Galaxy Zeus is a god bay, but it's basically a chosy bay, guys, because it has metal in the layer, right? And that means it's chosy, even though it has a god ship. No, totally not. Galaxy Zeus is not that good compared to chosy bays. But we're gonna roll with it anyways, because the Chosy uh, stamina type bays are power. Like, look at this. You have Geist Factor. And you have uh, Archer Hercules. Debatably, like, the best Chosy bay. Also, you have Crash Ragnarok. Crash Ragnarok kind of sucks, but he's there anyway. Anyways, yeah, let's get this battle started. Actually, before I start this battle, I just want to explain the new kind of system that we're going to be using for this battle. It's going to be an elimination system. Usually, I do, like, a point system based off teams. So, like, say, um... This is a system we did before. Let's say Crash Ragnarok beats Salamander. That means Crash Ragnarok would get a point for the stamina type team and the team with the most points at the end win. We're not going to do that this time. This time we're going to do like an elimination system. So let's say Crash Ragnarok and Salamander verse and Ragnarok beats Salamander. That means Salamander's eliminated and it, he can't use, I can't use Salamander for the rest of the battle. And it's basically uh, the team with the last base standing wins. It sounds kind of confusing. I'm not really good at explaining things, but you'll you'll see once the battle goes on. Anyways, yeah, let's get this battle started. I'll put them in like a random order order. Alright, this is the random order. So you have the first phase that's going to be versing is going to be Salamander versus, uh, uh, what, what you call it? Geist Factor. So yeah, let's get this battle started. The battle between the, def uh, <laughs> the left spin days. I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm really bad at talking. I don't know why. I just woke up, guys. Forgive me. Anyway, let's get this battle started. I'm going to put Salamander on defense mode just because I think defense mode probably the better mode, even though, like, attack mode so fun to watch, seeing it jump around stuff. Defense mode just so much better. And in the anime, it makes it look like attack mode. It's, like, so savage, so awesome. But in real life, it, it kind of just sucks. So yeah, let's get this battle started. Three, two, one, go. Shoot. There is Salamander in defense mode. Three, two, one, two. And there is Fafner going crazy with the absorb break. I'm not gonna count that because I don't think there was contact. There might have been contact, but there wasn't really that much contact. So I'm not gonna count that round. All right, let's try that one more time. Three, two, one, go two. Three, two, one, go two. There are the two big plays. Oh my gosh, I hate, I mean, I love, it's a. It's like a love-hate relationship with me and Geist Fafner. I love Geist Fafner's design, but the absorb tip is just so bad. You want to like slightly hard, you know, go around the stadium like crazy. That's not what stamina types are supposed to do, I'm sorry. And it doesn't even have that much stamina against left spin bays. Geist Fafner is really good against right spin bays, but against left spin bays, it's just booty. It literally just lost a Salamander. You're supposed to be a stamina type. You're supposed to have a lot of stamina, Geist Fafner. What are you doing? All right, let's do that battle one more time. Three, two, one, two. Also, uh, the battle are gonna be up to two points. Three, two, one, go. Two. All right, let's see how it goes. Uh, Geist Fafner is giving us. Oh, all right, Geist Fafner giving some strong attacks. Even though he's not an attack type, he's supposed to be a stamina type. He gives some solid attacks. All right, so the score is one to one. Three, two, one, go. Two. I'm not gonna change. Oh, I actually changed. Uh, what you call it? Uh, Salamander's mode. Salamander. The, oh. Gosh, I'm talking about bad drivers. Chosy has just given us some, like, really bad drivers. Like, come on, Chosy. What are these drivers? Like, I mean, Absorb, it's, they're both really cool concepts, but they both suck. Like, Absorb, even though it's an awesome concept, it literally acts like an attack tape half the time. And Operate, even though it's an awesome con uh, concept, it, like, switches modes half the time, too. And it just sucks. So, yeah, we're gonna put it, should we, actually, should we put Salamander in attack mode for the lulls? Should we do that? That actually means so much fun. Oh, man. Ah. I kind of, I said that I would put it on the better mode, but I think I'm going to have to go attack mode just because it's more fun, you know. Three, two, one, go two. All right, whatever, Salamander. I'm sorry, you're screwing over your team because I want to have fun. All right, oh, he just jumped on, oh, he's, ju he's jumping on Fafner. Oh, my God. He's probably going to lose, though, because I put him on the worst mode. Oh, I feel, I feel bad, but, like, oh, it was so cool. All right, so it looks like Fafner wins because I'm a jerk. All right, next battle. Uh, the next battle is going to be, be between, oh, wait, yeah, so Fafner beats Salamander. That means Salamander's eliminated, and you have to use another balance type Beyblade. So the next balance type Beyblade on the list is gonna be Z Achilles. So yeah, let's get this battle start. Who's gonna win, Geist Fafner or Z Achilles? In the anime, they would say Geist Fafner wins because three B uh 
I got in that battle. So yeah, three, two, one, go shoot. There's Guy Fafner. Three, two, one, go shoot. There is the Achilles. And I always, oh, 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 we just got destroyed. Guy Fafner. I was talking trash about about Guy Fafner, but he's like destroying all the Beyblades now. All right. Anyway, I'm gonna go serious mode though. I'm gonna put the Achilles on stamina mode. And if you guys don't know, the Extend Plus Driver for some reason it has insane life. Actually, not for some reason. Look how round the tip is. The tip is so round. So it has like extreme life after death like you'll see in this battle all right ready three two one go shoot like who do you think's gonna win guys Fafner with his absorb driver or z achilles with its um extend driver let's see extend for some reason has so much life after death i'm saying that and it's probably gonna lose because that's that's what always happens all right who's gonna win this battle and the winner is gonna be all right i think that was the tie we're gonna try that one more time all right three two i'm z achilles might have won that one but i think it was a tie three two one go shoot all right there we go three two one Go. That was a missed launch. Let's try that one more time. Three, two, one. Go. Shoot. All right, there's two Beyblades going in the middle. Oh, no! Oh my gosh! Oh, I. Oh no! I think Guys Fafner is just gonna wreck the whole entire team. Cause who do we have left? We have like we have Duo Eclipse or uh Duo. I guess it's what's it called? Now that's left. It's like left. Eclipse or something. I think that's what it's called. And we have uh, Hades or uh, Dead Hades. Hades. Dead Hades is actually a really good Beyblade. But like against Guys Fafner, I don't think it's gonna do much. Actually, no, 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 no. He's a left base, so he's probably gonna wreck Guys Fafner. All right. So the next battle we have Guys Fafner versus um. Uh, left Eclipse, let's get this battle started. 3, 2, 1, go shoot. There's Guy Fafner. 3, 2, 1, go shoot. There's Left Eclipse. Let's see who's gonna win this battle. I swear, if Guy Fafner beats Left Eclipse, I'm actually even gonna be kind of mad. Alright, Left Eclipse, you gotta beat Guy Fafner. We can't let the stamina types just like totally wreck the balance types. Balance types are like my favorite type, so if they actually lose, I'm gonna be so mad. Alright, so it looks like Duo Eclipse is able to beat Guy Fafner. Again, Guy Fafner, he's supposed to be a stamina type, but against Left and Bays, he literally has no stamina. 3, 2, and Guy Fafner jumped out of the stadium because the absorb driver sucks. Holy moly. Oh yeah, I, I also forgot to mention I put the uh, proof frame on Guy Fafner just to make it kind of more anime accurate. Because in the anime, uh Guy Fafner does use the proof frame. Alright, let's see what this how this battle goes. Alright, there it goes uh whatchamacallit? Uh <laughs> Eclipse attacking Guy Fafner. Is Guy Fafner gonna win this? Come on, Eclipse. Don't let Guy Fafner win this. Don't let Guy Fafner win this. Yes, come on, Scream Nation. Guy Fafner, die. Die, Guy Fafner. All right, so the winner of this battle is going to be uh, Duo or uh, Left Eclipse. Moving on to the next one. That means Guy Fafner is eliminated. The same types have to use another Beyblade. Next Beyblade on the list is going to be Galaxy Zeus. I'm sorry, Galaxy Zeus. You're about to get destroyed. I'm actually going to change uh, Eclipse's mode to like Right Spin just because I feel like Right Spin Eclipse is going to be a lot better than Left Spin Eclipse against um, uh, what you call? I, I don't know why I keep forgetting these Beyblade names. Uh, Galaxy Zeus. I, I literally just said Galaxy Zeus and I forgot about it. I, uh, it's probably gonna be Right Spin Eclipse. Probably gonna be a lot better on uh, against Galaxy Zeus and Left Spin Eclipse in my opinion, just because it's gonna be able to get more smash attacks and it won't have to rely on life after death. So yeah, let's get this battle started. Three, two, one, go. Shoot. Three, two, one, go. Shoot. All right, there. Oh, it, it literally just bursted. I remember uh, when Zeus first came out, it was the tankiest Beyblade ever. It felt like a tank, it never bursted. But now that all these Chosen Unity ca base came out with like all this metal, it's just not tanky anymore. It feels like such a light Beyblade now. Anyway, so yeah, what do you guys think about Right Spin Eclipse? I feel like Right Spin or Right Eclipse looks so much better than Left Eclipse. Just the purple looks so much better than the white they put on Left Spin Eclipse. But like Left Spins are so much cooler. I'm sorry to say it, but Left Spins are so so much cooler than right spins but like this one it has such a better design and you're moving on to the next one uh the next uh stamina that we have on the list is going to be uh archer hercules archer hercules is probably the best fate blade out there and i'm gonna keep uh eclipse on right spin just because if i put eclipse on left spin it'll be like a battle of life after death and eclipse cannot be archer hercules at life after death like he is the eternal driver the eternal driver is amazing at life after death so yeah let's get this battle started let's see who's gonna win archer hercules or eclipse i have my doubts i feel like Eclipse is definitely gonna lose this. Archer Hercules is just such an overpowered Beyblade. 3, 2, 1, go. There's Archer Hercules. I think Archer Hercules is definitely the best uh, stamina type Beyblade and probably the best stuff Beyblade overall. Like, just look at this thing. It literally comes with, like, one of the most uh, competitive stamina type drivers and it is, like, one of the most competitive uh, layers out there. It has, like, crazy. I was. 
All right, he was, I thought he was about to lose. <laughs> I, was, I was just like complimenting him like crazy. I was like hyping him up. He, he was just about to lose. That would, that would have been like really awkward if he did lose. Anyway, so yeah, let me hype him up some more. Like Archer Hercules, its teeth are amazing. It doesn't burst. Its layer is like super, I want. I don't want to say round, but it's like super aerodynamic. So it has like a lot of stamina. All the weight's on like um the outer. So it's going to give it even more stamina. Plus it has the 13 disc, which is decent. It's not the heaviest disc in the world, but it's not bad. It's not something like 11 or 12. And finally, it has the Eternal Driver, which is the Eternal Driver. It's just amazing. It's just such a good driver. It's such a good Beyblade overall. Such a solid Beyblade. Such a good Beyblade. Stop combo, at least. 3, 2, 1, good. <laughs> Compared to other stop combo Beyblades, it'll wreck. 3, 2, 1, good. I think, like, literally this combo itself is actually a competitive combo. At least I've heard. I've heard that Archer Hercules stop combo actually can stand up to a competitive Beyblade, which is crazy. Alright, let's see who wins this battle. It's probably going to be Archer Hercules. It's definitely gonna be Archer Hercules. Archer Hercules literally just demolishes. So yeah, moving on to the last uh, uh, balance type Beyblade we have is gonna be Dead Hades. So that means if Dead Hades loses this, then we have no more balance type Beyblades, which means the uh, Santa type Beyblades win. I'm probably not gonna do this system for like later battles because it's confusing me. If it's confusing me, it's probably confusing you guys too. So yeah, let's get this battle started. Three, two, one, go shoot. There's Archer Hercules. Three, two, one, go shoot. And there is dead hades let's see who wins this battle oh my gosh all right i haven't done many battles with dead hades but the battle i have done dead hades rex is dead hades gonna be archer hercules guys oh my god is oh no no way i don't believe it all right, that's what I thought. That's what, oh, it was so close. That's what I thought. Dead Hades didn't win. But the battles I have done with Dead Hades, even though it has horrible teeth, the Zeta Dash Driver, it saves it. I've never seen Dead Hades burst, actually. Because of the Zeta Dash Driver, I guess it just makes it, like, a super burst resistance or whatever. Anyways, yeah, it also has, like, so much metal on it, so it stays in the stadium for a really long time. It's kind of like a station, it's kind of like an attack type, but, like, not too attack, but, like, also has, like, a lot of weight, so it has a lot of stamina. Probably, like, an amazing, it's an amazing balance if I really like Dead Hades, but, again, probably not gonna stand up to Archer Hercules, just because Archer Hercules, it's just that good of a Beyblade, so, yeah, 3, 2, 1, go shoot. Hopefully, you can at least take one point from Archer Hercules, 3, 2, 1, go shoot. Maybe, like, win one battle. All right, Dead Hades, please beat him, please beat him. No, Dead Hades, you need to attack Archer Hercules if you want to beat him. Don't go around him, attack him, attack him. Also, in the anime, uh, Dead Hades is owned by um, Hearts. I think he's like Fi's brother. And Hearts, he's crazy. Like, he literally just destroyed Aiga. Aiga was champion for like a week, and then Hearts came and he destroyed him. I feel like, do you think... Oh, I thought I thought Dead Hades was gonna win that. Do you think uh, Hearts is better than Vault, guys? You think Hearts? If you, if you think Iga didn't beat Vault back then, and Hearts went up against Vault, do you think Hearts would be able to beat Winning Valkyrie, or do you think Winning Valkyrie would be able to beat Dead Hades? I feel like Winning Valkyrie would be able to beat defeat be Dead Hades. I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. I feel like Winning Valkyrie would be able to defeat Dead Hades, and Iga was only able to defeat Winning Valkyrie just because of main character powers. Anyway, so yeah, uh, Archer Hercules literally like destroyed all of the bounce set Beyblades. We didn't even get. To use Crash Ragnarok. So yeah, the winner of this battle is the Stamina Type Beyblades. Remember to come subscribe. If this uh, system was confusing, tell me it's confusing in the comment section. I'll change it next time. So yeah, see you guys later. Have a nice day. Left first out.